Hi everybody and welcome to Tech Tuesday with Jim. Have you ever wanted to have a classroom management tool that would help you monitor the noise level in your classroom? You could put it up on your whiteboard and all of the students would be able to see the noise level changing in the classroom. Well that's what this week's Tech Tuesday with Jim is. It's called Bouncy Balls. Hey, watch this and you'll get to see how Bouncy Balls works. In order to use bouncy balls on your computer, you just go to https colon forward slash forward slash bouncyballs.org and you click the begin bouncing. And you'll see that you have a bunch of multicolored balls on your screen. You can change the amount of bounciness. So the higher you go here, the more sensitive your microphone, the further down you go this direction, the less sensitive your microphone is. You can change the number of balls that will appear on your screen just like that and you can go into full screen mode which will get rid of like all of the uh, banner or whatever I happen to have on the top of my screen or my tray that's on the bottom of the screen that you can't see right now but it's there and then my microphone is turned off so I need to turn it on in order for all of the bouncing to start happening so here we go hello there everybody yeah now you can see it's reacting to my voice if I want to make it more sensitive just slide it up and now it's extremely sensitive and picks everything up or I can desensitize the microphone and bring it down and it barely moves. You also have the luxury of choosing over on the side over here what mode you'd like it to be in. So if we go emoji it's replaced by little emoticons on the screen. Emojis. Uh, you can go to bubbles which are kind of interesting because the bubbles start at the top and bubble down. That's kind of a neat little twist on it. And you can use the all-time favorite eyeballs. So you have eyeballs on the screen too. All right, I'm back with James and uh, he was just watching the little uh, bouncy balls presentation I was putting together. What are you doing, James? I'm being a bouncy ball. You're being too loud. <laughs> oh, you're being a smart aleck. <laughs> right. Yeah. Well, bouncy balls. Do you like the bouncy ball site, James? Yeah. How come? Uh. Well, sometimes the kids in my class can be a little too loud, and our teacher can put it up on the board, and she can just see how loud we're being. Yeah. Does it help? Yeah. Yeah. Most time, except for you, right? <laughs> yeah. All right. So, well, that's the bouncy ball site. It's free, you can use it on your computer, put it up on your whiteboard. Very, very simple to be able to use. So, have fun with the site Bouncy Balls. 